What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are going to be taking a look at Arena today for the single target DPS uh, to see what you know what sort of team you have. The best kind of team that is out there currently. I mean it's very easy to go and find the best kind of team right. Um, you can see here Garn is going to be in pretty much all of these top teams simply because how much he boosts. Boost the damage of Valeria. Um, also Ardea. But Ardea again is another ancient hero. That's very tough to have. If you have Ardea. Fantastic. Good for you. Um, you're very very lucky to have all of them as well. Uh, so let's go and have a look. Let's go through a battle and see what's up. I'm not going to attack Blutgot. Because he has gone. He has Valeria. Um, Zilla 2. Not too worried about. Uh, this Silas as well was A0. I mean maybe. Do you know what? Do you know what? Let let. Let's attack it and see what happens. Okay, so the team that we're using is Torador, Valeria. Now, Garn outshines Torador, okay? He just does. Um, he just boosts Valeria damage so much, you know, which is losing our health. Arrogance is in this team. Uh, Silas and Dolores. Now, you could argue that Dolores doesn't need to be in the team, but I like having her in it. I like having her in it. Um... You may be able to find an extra DPS to throw in there. Now, straight away, people are going to be throwing in... Throwing in their Valeria, okay? And they're going to use their ultimate instantly. Instantly. That's because the lower health she is, the more damage she does. Uh, you can see he's also popped... He should have popped his. Has he not? Has he not? He hasn't. You see? And now he's falling back. That's because he hasn't popped it. Now, Silas will come in next. And he's going to help burst down the heroes. You can see that that exploded there, okay? He's dead already. And look how much longer this is taking him. He's taking too long to pop his ultimate. Too, too long. We're going to hold off on Dolores a moment, and we're going to throw an Arrogance next. We've already taken 38% of his tower. So, Valeria is still taking a bit more damage, which means she's doing more damage. We're not going to pop our silos just yet. We're going to pop him now. And we're going to throw an Arrogance. Just, mm, hang on. Hang on. We're going to throw Arrogance in underneath underneath Valeria, so he can get the buff as well. We did lose that one, it's because we popped our Silas late, but we're into the next wave here. Pop a Valeria, throw in Dolores, everyone's going to get the buffs in a moment when it's ready. Now this wave here, wave 5, uh, in fact I think I may have used my Valeria a little bit too early. Because this next wave is nasty, they hit so hard, and this can be a lesson to you if that is the case. It's, you can see he's holding his because he knows. Oh, it's not the next wave. What's the wave six where the scythe like freaking demons come in and they're just vicious. Okay, they will rip you up, eat you, and spit you out. All right, that's as simple as that. They just will. Come on, Valeria. Hold off. Hold off, baby. You got it. Yeah, you got it. That's a go. Okay. Now, here come. The nasty ones, right? These guys will slice you so hard, they will just kill you, okay? Hope we can get the explosion on one. Oh, we did get an explosion, but it's not quite enough. Torador needs to come in here. I feel like I'm commentating. Well, I kind of am. Um, Torador's in now, but is it going to be enough? I don't know. Is he going to get the kill? Are we going to kill? We're looking good. We're looking good. Garn's down here. You can see this may be AI that's happened to him now. Valeria's gone in there as well. We should kill his tower now. Yeah. So that's a win. Which I was actually surprised at, to be honest. I didn't expect to win that one. Um, but the auto is set up now. What I am concerned about is in that auto fight, we did place Torador over the top of Valeria. So, mm, how's that going to work in auto? I don't know. I don't know. Um... What's this vicious got? Okay. Okay, similar kind of team. He's using Salazar in place of Silas. I mean, Silas is great because he's a cheaper hero, right? He's 12 cost. He can do a great amount of single target damage. You know this already. Let's see how the um, the, a the auto helps here. Is he going to be popping? His he has already popped it. That's why it died so fast. And he's How did he beat mine so much? My goodness. Jeez. Okay. So Silas is in with us now. Now we did wait a bit too long on our Silas last time around, didn't we? Seems to be okay on this wave. Remember, it's always different. Everything varies in Arena, alright? Everything just changes so much. 
I can't remember if we popped Valeria on this one. I think we did. We did. Arrogance has also been popped. And this next one is not the Scythes, is it? It's another wave of the big chunky guys. And he's dead. He's dead. Yeah, he's lost that one. Um, I mean, Salazar being the extra cost compared to Silas, it's just not anywhere good as in comparison, okay? That's why uh, Silas is, is great in here as well. It's a low cost, 12 cost, to go in with the other heroes. Uh, we have run out of attempts, but let's just do a couple more, okay? We'll do a couple more. Let's go against a Hex here. Hex, Valor... I'm reading my own team. Hex, Valeria, Silas, Dolores, and Torridor. And Torador, this could be an interesting one, but he hasn't got Garn, he's got the same Lord as me, Torador, so it should be fairly even, it should be mainly off of tactics and gear. Okay, so we just beat his Valeria there, and you'll know for yourself, if you face a Valeria in Arena, you are buggered, okay? Who the hell do you use in place? There is no one that can compete with Valeria, there just isn't. However, if you do have Valeria, Ardea, and Garn, or, you know, that kind of team, you are in business for single target arena. You just are. They're just that good. There is no replacement for them. And Silas, again, you can see he's brought his Silas in, but he did bring in Dolores earlier. He's also got a Hex in here. Hex him. Arrogance or Hex? Hmm. I mean, you can use Hex by all means. I guess he does nuke a target down with crazy damage. Don't know. Wave 6, pop it. Oh, thank goodness, we popped it. Is he gonna... Now, where's Torador going? Is he coming in? Did he come in? He did come in. Okay, he did come in. I was getting ready then. <laughs> I think we've lost anyway. We haven't got the damage here right now. Arrogance has been killed. Our demon is out of range of our Silas as well. So later on in the waves, this currently isn't working. Okay, this currently isn't working. It may be worth me just moving um, Arrogance to a slightly different location. Or I could try Hex. Do you know what? Do you know what? No, because I want the attack speed. I want the attack speed. I want... Let's, let's take out Dolores. Let's take out Dolores and see how this goes. Okay, I'm hoping we'll have... Because I'd much rather nuke down an enemy rather than bring in a Torador. The Valeria is in. Get ready to pop the ultimate. There we go. And we know that this guy has a good rotation, so we should be able to set a good defense here. We should be able to set a good defense. Silas is coming in next. I'm actually going to put Silas here, just in case they do leak again. Just in case they do leak again. I know that we don't have Dolores here now, so it doesn't matter. Okay, it doesn't matter. We're not looking to buff everyone. But just in comparison, look, he does have Dolores on his team. And we're still going strong. It's not making a huge difference right now. And later on, you really do need that damage, okay? So, Arrogance. Do we place him? I'm going to place him here. Place him here. Because they're still going to target Valeria. Now, hold off a moment. Hold off a moment. Because we want that for the next wave. Right, so here comes this wave. Pop Valerie in now because she is getting low. Um, we're going to put Salazar behind Valeria. Okay, now we can still trigger. We can still trigger that. Ultimate, oh no, that's not good. That's not good. We don't have our Torador. I mean, we can nuke one of these. That We're buggered. We are buggered. We couldn't even nuke it down, could we? Salazar tanking, look at this. Come on, Torador. Oh. All right, this is a loss. <laughs> this is a loss. 
Um, did we need our Dolores there? Did we need... I don't want this team being saved. We're going to exit anyway, being a loss. Um, that did not work right. Our Valeria struggled. Maybe I should... I think I should have popped her a wave earlier. That's what I did last time. I don't think I held off so long. So we're going to try. All right. So we're going to bring in Dolores. And we're taking out Arrogance. And we're going to throw in Salazar. Just to see how this team works in place of not having Dolores in there. Will this one be enough for us to... You know, that little bit of health regen actually does help quite a bit for Valeria. So she is in. I don't know if I should be one more tile back either, to be honest. I know he's an extra tile back. Hmm. It could potentially be better because Silas here is, is that extra tile there is wasted. If he was here and Valerie was there, Dolores was here, that may be more viable. So we're just going to hold off a minute. No. Yeah, we are. Oh, this is a terrible video. Terrible video, I'm so sorry. So we lost that round. We're going to pop Silas in and have it a little bit longer in the next round as well. Now, Dolores can come in. Everyone's got the buff now. Everyone's placed. We hold off. We can pop it now. So we'll be ready for wave five. Save our ultimate. Okay, so here it comes. After this wave is the nasty one. We need to pop our silos like he just did. Now. We're going to wait on our Valeria a moment. Style has got the kill there. Next one is in. Another kill. Perfect. So we should be into wave 7. And I can't remember if... If they're the same or not on wave 7. Now, Torador can come in her place, so everyone's still in range. It would be better if I did move it back one, wouldn't it? Pop our Silas. Still got Salazar. Silas gets the kill. How is he doing here? We're way too far behind. That actually, it may just be enough. It's just enough to beat it. So that tactic actually worked better for me that way around. Still having Dolores in there. Um, having Salazar in there in place of Arrogance. And obviously waiting to place that Torador. Waiting to place that Torador. It was a little bit longer than I hoped it would be this video. But it's important for me to show a few different strategies in place, isn't it? Um, so I'll see all of you in the next video. Have a fantastic day, even wherever you are. Goodbye.